Hello everyone and welcome to A Town Rabbit Tree. Um, I'm Courtney and uh, it's time to do a little bit of updating. Um, first one I have on the table here is um, Simon. If you've watched my uh, trailer video, you see him mentioned. Um, he is the oldest homegrown uh, rabbit here at the rabbit tree. He is five months old. And he is um, for sure going to be on the show team uh, for a little while at least. And it looks like he has pooped on the table. Um, but I just wanted to show him off a little bit. He is... Oh, great. Look what he did. Thanks a lot, Simon. We just got started. Um, give me a second here. Okay. We tried a different rug, but he's just too excitable. He just can't seem to not poop on everything. Um, he sprayed that first rug and I only have one other and just don't want to take a chance of him spraying another one. So I got him in this spare cage. Simon, come here. Come here. Whoa. I just got sprayed. That's just not lovely. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. Settle down. Hey, he is, um, he has sprayed me before, but I didn't think he would, <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, anyway, I was going to pose him for you, but he is, like, seriously not wanting to pose. Okay. Anyway, this is Simon. <laughs> he is out of Banks and Jasmine. Um... Five months old. I plan to start showing him next month. He'll be six months old at that point. So he'll be in the intermediate class. Um, I think he's pretty, not too far from senior weight if I do remember. I don't remember how much you weigh. I'll put that in on here. But anyway, that is Simon. Okay, um, moving on. Uh, this is the first one we're going to look at from uh, Jake and Jasmine Litter. Um, she is, I say, 14 weeks. Something like that. Anyway, this is Precious. Um, she's also going to be on the show team. It's kind of hard to hold a camera and pose at the same time. But you can kind of get a general idea of her profile here. Um, she will be a junior. Um, I think she's a pretty promising young doe. And she's a sweetheart. <laughs> Let's look at your face. As you can see, she's got quite a bit of color on her face. And she's just a sweet girl. It looks like she's kind of blowing a little coat today, but that's all right. So this is Precious. Um, right now we're kind of just naming all of our rabbits. <laughs> we have so many names we want to use and uh, you know so anyway that is Precious. Okay next up is the sister. This is Nibbles. Um, you'll notice her face is a lot like Simon. Um, but her marking is on the opposite side, I do believe. Yeah, on her nose. And she is a, a lighter patterned rabbit. Um, she will just kind of pose a little bit. Um, she's got a lot of white on her. Um, I really like that. But that's just personal preference. Um, so, you know, everybody has their preference on a broken pattern. Um, you may have remembered seeing her in a previous video. If you look on her back, it looks like an eye. There you go, you can see it. Um, if she was a, if she had been a buck, I was gonna call her Mr. Incredible, but <laughs> uh, end up being a girl. And <laughs> they just want to explore today. They've been cooped up in their cages and it's the cold weather and today is fairly nice. It's actually, I need to back up to look at the thermometer. It's just a little over 40 degrees in the barn today. So uh, that is absolutely wonderful. 
because uh, I feel like being outside. Look at her climbing. Where are you going? Where are you going? We all are over here. We don't want to just see her rump. Um, um, but as you know, all of them are probably going to need a little practice with um, posing before we start the show season. She's kind of posing for you. You can see her profile partially. So anyway, uh, we have one more to look at from that litter. So here he comes. Okay, put him up here. So this is the only surviving buck out of uh, that litter of 10. Uh, this is Edward. Oh, he's posing, sort of, partially. He's a beautifully marked broken. I love these spots on his head. <laughs> right here. I love those. He's a sweet boy. Um, named him Edward because um, there's something about him that it has it says royalty about him. I don't know why, but for some reason he just seems like royalty to me. So um, this is Edward. Here, back up, Edward. We want to look at you. I think he's gorgeous. Uh, he's also going to be on the show team. Uh, want to get some some judges' opinions on him. Can we see your other side? Maybe we'll just take the camera on the other side. As you can see, he's uh, fairly even in coat pattern. Sorry about my shadow. Anyway, it's Edward. Hey, Edward. All right, uh, up next is the blues. Whoa. Okay, the first one I want to show you is uh, Miss Blue Water. Um, she is not going to be shown um, and it's, there's a very good explanation for that. Let's see if I can lift her up. See that belly? That belly is tan. Um, that is not going to work on the show table. Um, unfortunately her brother who was, uh, solid blue, with a blue belly and everything, he was perfect, perfect, perfect. He came down with bloat and, um, after he died, um, we lost two more out of this litter. Um, let's see her. They're 11 weeks old. Um, she is the only one that did not uh, come down with bloat. So um, she is the biggest right now out of her litter. So when you see the next three, just know that they, uh, they've gone through a lot in the last couple of weeks. So um, just keep that in mind when you see them. So this is Blue Water. Um, more than likely, we're going to we're going to keep her anyway. Uh, we're going to add her to our colony. Um, we think she will be a good mom out there. So, anyway, up next. Okay, this is an, another female. This is another doe. Um, this is the only broken doe I have. Uh, that's that's a broken blue. Uh, this is Blue Cheese. Um, she went through bloat. Um, she was the second one to get bloat, and so she has been on the mend, uh, recovering. She's recovering quite nicely, though. Um, she a little skittish, but you know they're 11 weeks old. They're still. I handle them as much as I can, but with this cold weather, I just can't. I can't get out here as much as I like to. So this is blue cheese. I plan to show her. Um, uh, in case you're curious, um, the broken blues and the broken blacks and, bro and broken reds all are shown at the same time. So they're not separate categories. So she is going to be up against uh, Nibbles and Precious both and any other brokens on the table. Um, she probably won't get to go to show until later on. Um, because she lost weight with the bloat and um, so it may take her a little longer to get to the minimum weight of six pounds. Okay, okay here's our first buck. This is Blue Paint. Um, he probably was the sickest uh, to recover and uh, he is recovering quite nicely. Um, he's eating on his own, he's drinking on his own, he's doing pretty good. Um, this time last week he wasn't feeling very good, 
So um, he's looking great now. Um, just need to put some weight on and fill in a little bit. Um, but as you can see, he's, he's got a pretty good coat pattern. You can see that. <laughs> they all just want to explore that wall. Anyway, that's our first buck, blue paint. All right, last of our broken blues is Blue Ocean. Um, he uh, he didn't get bloat near as bad as, as any of the others. He was probably the most mild case I had. Um, I think he only had to be treated for a couple of days. But um, he's looking great. Um, as you can see, he's quite a bit bigger than his brother or even uh, his sister's. But he's a pretty big guy. He's a sweetheart. As you can see, he's exploring everything. <laughs> All right, so up next is going to be Jake and Anna's litter. Uh, we're gonna go take a look at them. Okay, here we are. This is Anna's cage. Hello, Anna. And as you can see, her babies are in a pile back there. Um, it's hard to distinguish one from another on the camera. She's uh, chewing on ice, in case you're curious what the sound is. Um, I'm getting ready to give everybody some fresh water. So um, I'm sure you'd like to see exactly how big these guys are. <laughs> Here's one. There we go. They are two and a half weeks old. Um, she had 13 to begin with. And... Um, we tried fostering three to a doe that kindled uh, the day after and um, she exposed them to the cold and they died um, and then let's see here uh, Anna still had a, she had one that was kind of weak and it got pushed out of the bundle and it died and then um, last week um, she, I don't know how, but one was out of the box and it passed away. So here we are. We've got eight healthy two and a half week old babies. So uh, that's all the babies we have here now. And uh, that's our update. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Facebook and thanks for watching. Bye.